What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. So after our last NASCAR Heat 4 career mode update, Martinsville was not a good time. It was a major wreck fest, but we're heading to Phoenix. 10 lap race, $40,500 purse. Let's get our truck together. Do, do, do. Let's see here. We don't have a single aero specialist. So, suspension. And we'll make this truck just as dominant. So, frustrating at Martinsville last race, but hey, gotta move on, gotta move forward. We're gonna have an 85, 83, 84 for Phoenix. Let's get ready to head to the track. This whole career mode thing is, it's fun. Don't get me wrong, it's really, front, or really fun. Can get nerve wracking sometimes, just being honest with you, because you really have to fight to perform well. And uh, sometimes you don't really have a chance to prove yourself because your truck or your equipment is just not where it needs to be. Um, there's only two races left in the season for the truck series. So within this upload and the next upload, we should be getting ready to move on to yet again another season in our career. And I'm curious to see where that takes us. I want to see if we're able to start our own Xfinity team. Um, see if we can, one, drop the Extreme Dirt Tour series. Uh, just kind of don't feel like running in that anymore. We were just way too freaking dominant winning 10 out of 14 races. I'd much rather be dominant in the truck series or be super dominant in the Xfinity series. So, let's skip practice. Let's definitely qualify. Goal qualifying time is at 29.051. See how our uh, 94 Hooters Ford does here today. Hopefully for the next season in the truck series, we get a different sponsor and we can make our truck look a little bit better than what it does. Um, really, really hoping we can get some good paint schemes going for, for the next season. So, qualifying time, like I said, is a 29.051. Running at Phoenix. Let's see how we do here. Really shooting low on the track. Not sure if this is legal at all. I highly doubt it. But hey, you know, we got to do what we got to do to put up some good qualifying times. Hopefully that benefits in our favor doing that. As we are coming out of the final turn, heading to the start finish line, we are not going to meet our goal time. Almost a half a second off, and we are starting in 20 freaking first. Well, shit. Let's get ready to race. Phoenix Raceway. Christian Eck has failed technical inspection. He'll be starting in the back. Johnny Sauter, our friend, was the pole winner. Josh Balicki had to replace the transmission before the race. He will also be starting in the back. All right. Start next to our good buddy, Mr. Greenfield. Looks like Gillen is in P4. Definitely having to uh, watch out and look for Gillen and Moffitt because they are both really not too kind to us. So, 10 lap race. Not trying to run your dirty greenfield, but I need the spots. Beautiful. All right, let's shoot down low here. Hopefully without causing any riffraff. Try not to piss as and many people off this weekend. I know we're going to piss people off. You know, I don't understand. Gillen always puts up, like, decent qualifying times. And then, like, some races, he is just absolutely dominant. And then other races, man, like, he falls back. And he falls back quick. Let's get underneath Boyd here. Didn't want to push you up like that because it's going to do nothing but fuck us both here. Let's shoot back down. Didn't mean to hit you, Mr. Rhodes. All right, let's get back in on that inside line. Took over P13. 
Burton are kind of slow, so get the hell out of the way. Thank you. Dude, if you're not going to get out of my way, then I'm going to move you out of my way. The last thing you want to happen is me to move you out of my way. I have to lock my brakes up one more time for Burton. I'm gonna send him so freaking hard on the wall. Sorry, Clickerman. Trying to fight for a top 10 here, boys. Trying to fight here. Top 10 would be great. Sitting P12, floating between P12 and P13. Driving like a dick. Kinda had to, just to get that P9 spot. Perfect, let's try to get a run here with Shelvin Creed. Beautiful. Looks like that's Todd right in front of us, P7. Dude, why, why, why does everybody get a run on me? I know my truck's not good. Like I said, there's only two races left in this season, which is here at Phoenix and then wherever we're heading to next week. So in the next upload, that will be our season ender in the truck series. Dude, really? Like, I get it. You're faster than me. But I drive more like an asshole, man. So stop. Just, just, just stop. All right. That's it. No more Mr. Nice Cook. Not losing his top ten. Not because of you, Benjamin. You can get the hell out of my way is what you can do. Go ahead, try to get around. Burton. Maybe I should stop driving like a dick, because I feel like that's my downfall every race, is because I drive like a dick, and then I end up shocking myself. So we lost our top 10. I believe we might be able to make it back. We have a lap and a half to do it. Just need two spots. Two freaking spots. As we come up to the white flag, we are in P13 as we cross the line. Just got passed by Dipple. Shooting back to the inside of Dipple. I was hoping I would ricochet off of him. But we just caused a little bit of mayhem behind us. Looks like we are going to secure as long as we can make it through this turn somewhat smooth and the 44 truck does not wreck us we are going to come in p12 well guys this is going to be a shorter nascar heat 4 update so i think the next one we're going to finish our truck series and uh season anyway and uh maybe start the next year for the game and uh, just kind of collab that into one video. So, P12 for today, payout was $26,657. We are 13th in points now. And we are four points behind our good old friend, Todd Gillen. Like I said, Really, really trying to focus on proving a point here, but proving a point and finishing well are two different things I need to do both. So if this was your first time watching a video on my channel, I hope you guys give this video a big thumbs up. Smash that subscribe button down below, and I will catch you guys in the freaking next one. See you.